The first one is called Beginnings. It's a center. Unseen by each other, we have been transformed. And the contradictions that emerge, that hold the world in place, abstracts you in some way from nature. You stand in this morning's shadows, more common than the wind. It is time to be thankful for the breath we feel somehow between us. Now is the morning of that day. We will live in the light like the genius of shadows, known only to few in certain high mountains. This is called Greenwich Village, and it is after a poem I love very much by Louise Glick. And it's about the fall, so we're an appropriate to read it today. Autumn leaves blow gold, rust, and crimson as a jazz band plays Mercy, Mercy, Mercy. I met my love under the Brooklyn Bridge. Or was it the ark in Washington Square Park? Did I imagine him? Did he touch my hair? I have dealt with the nuns who live in convents. I have seen the children who jump double dutch. He squeezed my hand. Did I dream this? I drown in my swim. Is he the reason? I met my love under the Brooklyn Bridge. Who is my love? Disappearing, ice melting, eclipse. Then the subway returned me to my home I had forgotten. I went away from writing for a really long time. I was painting a lot of pictures. And um, like a year ago, I had two things accepted. One was in an anthology for women, and the other was in a magazine. And like I haven't heard anything about it. And then like about a month ago, in the same week, I get an email. The magazine's out. What's your address? And the, antho and the anthology will be out in November. And it was just like, just gave me like, oh my god, maybe I should keep writing and send things out. So this is a poem that's going to be in a forthcoming anthology of New York women writers. It's also a sento. I love doing sentos. When I can't write, I, I, I do sentos. This is like that of the purple orchid in my garden. The moon tonight is dazzling, is full. In dreams, I'm wild with guilt. Entering the seawater at twilight, like Blake, naked in his garden, I'd give anything for one more night and part my lips with a globe. Be gentle with me, I'm new to this. As dawn breaks, he enters. I lay down in the tweed of one man, that first frost night, as in a children's book, composed entirely of snow. Thank you, thank you. This is my last poem. And this is a poem that is in response to a guy who was chasing me and he told me, don't write about life, write about art. So this is called Art. It was art, abstract and alcohol fueled, liquid paint splattered, graffiti covered and dangerous, surreal, savage beauty of Alexander McQueen, Spray paint guns aimed at a white dress. Fragile. An evening gown made of peonies and roses disintegrating. You say, don't write about life, write about art. Was it not art? The finger painting of my hair, the pigment of your eyes, the sculpture of my thigh. You say, don't write about life, write about art. Was it not art? my solo performance when you left me nude in the gallery covered in snow. Thank you very much. <laughs>